Canonical Limited is a UK-based privately held computer software company founded and funded by South African entrepreneur Mark Shuttleworth to market commercial support and related services for Ubuntu and related projects. Canonical employs staff in more than 30 countries and maintains offices in London, Austin, Boston, Shanghai, Beijing, Taipei, and the Isle of Man. Projects Canonical Limited has created and continues to back several projects. Principally these are free and open source software or tools designed to improve collaboration between free software developers and contributors. Some projects require a contributor license agreement to be signed. Open source software Ubuntu Linux, a Debian-based Linux distribution with GNOME formerly with Unity desktop Ubuntu Core, tiny, transactional version of Ubuntu New Bazaar, a decentralized revision control system Storm, an object relational mapper for Python, part of the Launchpad codebase Juju, a service orchestration management tool Mass, a bare metal server provisioning tool Upstart, an event-based replacement for the init daemon Quickly, a framework for creating software programs for Linux Ubiquity, installer Mere display server Snappy package manager Snapcraft, Python-based tool for packaging software Launchpad a centralized website containing several component web applications designed to make collaboration between free software projects easier. PPA, a special software repository for uploading software packages to be built and published as an apt repository. Blueprints, a tool for planning features of software. Code, hosting of bazaar branches. Answers, support tracker. Rosetta, an online language translation tool to help localization of software CF, the Rosetta Stone Malone as in Bugsy Malone, a collaborative bug tracker that allows linking to other bug trackers Soyuz, a tool for creating custom distributions, such as Kubuntu and Zubuntu other projects and services Landscape, a proprietary web service for centralized management of Ubuntu Linux systems Ubuntu One, a discontinued service for file synchronization and other users Canonical supplies some of the core engineering to Linaro which invests in upstream projects Ubuntu Advantage, a commercial support service that covers Ubuntu and other canonical products. Topic: <laughs> Joint Ventures. Windows Subsystem for Linux with Microsoft. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Business Plans. In 2007, Canonical launched an international online shop selling support services and Ubuntu branded goods. Later in 2008, it expanded that with a United States specific shop designed to reduce shipment times. At the same time, the word Ubuntu was trademarked in connection with clothing and accessories. In a Guardian interview in May 2008, Shuttleworth said that Canonical's business model was service provision and that Canonical was not yet close to profitability. Canonical stated that it would wait three to five years to become profitable. Shuttleworth regarded Canonical as positioning itself as demand for services related to free software rose. This strategy has been compared to Red Hat's business strategies in the 1990s. In an early 2009 New York Times article, Shuttleworth said that Canonical's revenue was creeping 
Towards $30 million, the company's break even point, Canonical achieved a small operating profit of $281,000 in 2009, however, until 2017 it struggled to maintain financial solvency and took a major financial hit from the development of Unity and Ubuntu Touch, leading to an operating loss of $21.6 million for the fiscal year 2013. The company reported an operating profit of $2 million in 2017 after shutting down the Unity development team and laying off nearly 200 employees. The company now plans to focus on its server and professional support solutions, which have proved to be most profitable. By shifting resources away from Ubuntu desktop and cutting less profitable products and services, Canonical plans to maintain solvency and achieve long-term profitability. Topic. Subsidiaries Canonical Group Limited is located in London. Canonical USA Inc. is located in Boston, Massachusetts. Canonical China Limited is located in Shanghai. Canonical Brazil LTDA is located in Sao Paulo. Canonical Canada Limited is located in Montreal. The office is no longer in service. Canonical Limited Taiwan Bridge Chinese Yingshuman Dao Shangken Nuo Yuxian Gongsi Taiwan Fen Gongsi is located in Taipei. Topic: Employees. Canonical has more than 500 employees. The head office is in London on the fifth floor of the Blue Fin Building, Southwark Street, having previously moved from the 27th floor of Millbank Tower. In the summer of 2006, Canonical opened an office in Montreal to house its global support and services operation. Taipei 101 is also home to a Canonical office. There is also an OEM team in Lexington, Massachusetts, United States. Topic. Current Notable current employees of Canonical include Mark Shuttleworth, CEO and founder of the Ubuntu Project, former Debian maintainer of Apache and founder of Thought Consulting 2004, CEO until March 2010 and from July 2017 to present Jane Silber, Board of Directors, formerly CEO, March 2010 to July 2017, formerly COO and leader of the Ubuntu One project. Topic: <laughs> Past. Notable past employees: Ben Collins, former Debian project leader and kernel developer, 2006 to 2009. Jeff War, employee No. 3, Gnome and Planet Aggregator Developer, Business Development 2004-2006 Benjamin Mako Hill, Core Developer and Community Coordinator 2004-2005 Ian Jackson, Developer of DPKG and former Debian Project Leader 2005-2007 Lars Werzenius, first contributor to the Linux kernel and Linus Torvalds former office mate 2007 to 2009. Scott James Remnant, formerly a Debian and new maintainer of new libtool and co-author of the Planet Aggregator 2004 to 2011. Matt Zimmerman, formerly of the Debian security team, worked at Canonical as Ubuntu chief technical officer 2004 to 2011. Stuart Langridge 2009 to 2013 John O'Bacon Ubuntu community leader 2006 to 2014 Bjorn Michelson founding member and director at the Document Foundation LibreOffice contributor 2011 to 2017